Hi folks, we're in the Tartan coffee shop and there's this wonderful sculpture made of wood here. It's 99 pounds. Hi right, bro, are you paying today? Again. Oh, sorry bro. Hi right, folks, we're here in the Tartan restaurant where today I have ordered the soup of the day. It's gone controversial, soup of the day, but bro, however, has gone for um, the traditional scone. So we'll get Mark on the scone on from bro. Thank you. Right, folks, there is soup of the day and a roll with butter. Excellent. All oh, bro's scones arrived. Oh, the scone, folks, there it is. You said it looks a bit doughy, but you just have to keep a... Keep it, keep, oops. Oh, folks, there's a tonics caramel wafer. It's just different sort of things, different little pictures. Look, it's made of. Excellent. Only £29. I wonder if I should buy the prints up there, look. And again, that's only 29 quid. That's not bad, is it? Keep your phone on. Looks here, we are sitting in the sort of lounge area here at this tartan place absolutely wonderful look it's nice and cozy look it's got loads of nooks and crannies and settees and things absolutely brilliant and there's more pictures on the wall there look there's Marilyn Monroe and there's prints so yes great place to come and visit folks so definitely recommend um, a, a stop off here at Tartan on the Perth Road very nice indeed the soup was absolutely wonderful I give the soup 8 out of 10 it was really good there's loads of it and the roll and butter were good as well there's bro oh there's is that bro well I'm afraid I'm afraid Tartan lost some points there folks oh, just yeah. at the very end it was looking good but then I went to I stood the ice cream bit looking for an ice cream and there was two people just two customer two workers just stand there yapping about coffee or something and I was I was I actually shouted excuse me hello but I got rubbered and so I stood there for about four, well, how long bro, about four minutes maybe? Yeah, yeah. Lunch, yes. and uh, just, so I was like, well, you know what, sod this, so they've lost some marks there. Yeah. But all in all, it was a very good uh, soup, I enjoyed that, soup and rolls good. Bro, right, the all-important scone. Hello, testing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give my scone experience a seven and a half out of ten. Ooh, it's actually okay, well, not, bad not bad at all. Right, yeah, okay. not bad. Okay, seven and a half, so that's not bad on the scone -ometer. Right, folks, the rain is still pelting down, we've been fed and watered, we're off to find... Some more graffiti. Yes. Right, folks, here we are. What, what can you see? What can you see through the trees, through the palm trees here? Look, what is that? Looks like a penguin. Right, we thought we were all penguin out, folks, but we've actually found another one here. This is uh, quite, a, quite a good one, quite a clever one, because it's done in the style of a penguin book. You know the famous penguin covers? There it is there. So that's a penguin penguin, I think, is it? This was the... Um, the Penguin Classic, this is called, and it's The Old Man in the Sea by Ernest Hemingway is the the title on this penguin. So it's a penguin classic, complete and unabridged. Do you know what unabridged means, bro? Yes. What is that? I was okay, you do know? Yes. yes. Yeah, okay, right. That's you have fine, the then. famous Lemmings of Dundee as well. The famous Lemmings after the, the game. Lemmings was designed here in Dundee. There you go and the penguin right folks we're here in uh, the community garden here just down from robinson street and we're looking for the uh, some more graffiti this one is off the chuckle brother one of the chuckle brothers he who died recently so somebody's come up here i think it's the same guy sky simon matheson he's the graffiti artist sky and he's come up here and he's uh, he's done one of the chuckle brothers there's lots of more there's lots more graffiti here look excellent yes look at this folks loads of it everything's covered look even the log there is covered is there some here bro is it here he is which one is it bro which chuckle brother barry chuckle yeah so this guy's done this one there he is look very oh, good. Here it is, folks. The community garden stretches for miles. Loads of good stuff here. Look, excellent. Bro wanted me to do a, a for me to you thing, but now I'm not. I'm not. I'm not doing it. No, not doing it. No, nope. that's just too cheesy. No. Nope. Found a witch's hat, folks. Mm. Uh, uh, oh. 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 See this strange sort of cup 
Oh, a plastic cup thing. What's going on here? I don't know. What does that say? Ta uh, Something view. Tay view. And there we've got this. I wonder what that's all about. I'm not sure. Who knows? Pond life in Dundee, folks. Here we go. Let's see what's going on here. Careful not to slip. And there we have. The perfect pond. Frog life. We've got frogs in here. Right, excellent. Folks, so what we have here is a, uh, a frog spawning kind of pond. They're trying to um, make the, the pond into a, an amphibian sort of area. They can just chill out and relax and just be, just be amphibians and do what frogs and amphibians and utes do. So there it is, right in the middle of Dundee, folks. Fantastic. Frog zone. Apple tree, excellent. Look at the apples on there, look at them. Right, Brown Constable Street, folks, here we go. Right, folks, here we are on Brown Constable Street, where most people tend to think this has got something to do with the police, but it's got nothing at all, folks, to do with the police. What it's all about is uh, this guy called Colonel Charles Brown Constable, who succeeded to uh, a nearby Wallace Craig estate in 1852. Before that, it was just plain Constable Street, and that was in honour of another chap who was called George Constable, and he was a close friend of uh, Walter Scott. So there you go. But also, folks, Bro's going to tell you about this other most famous resident of this street, who, um, who I think she's dead now, but here's Bro to tell you all about her. Jenny Wood Allen, MBE, OBE, uh, was actually born here in Brown Constable Street in Dundee. Now, she was famous for marathon running, and she was 90 year old when she took part in the London Marathon as the oldest competitor ever. I think she finished near the back, but uh, she did really well. But she was born here, in Brown Constable Street, here in sunny Dundee. Okay. I found some more graffiti here, folks, but it's in the back of a pub, so I don't we're getting the Dragon's Den, the dungeon. Is that the, what's the pub called, the Dragon's Den? So it's in the back of this pub, folks, this graffiti. So it looks like we have to go into the pub and walk down into the... into the, uh, the the pub. Right, well, bro's, bro's actually going to hide up Spiz Badge, folks. Here we go. Here we go. Come with us as we uh, follow Bro to the to the place to hide the badge. It's going to be in this weaver's yard. Place. Bro's found a political activist and musician, 1897 to 1978. Very good. 